Cancel? Cancel? Cancel what? Cancel when? You already know what it is, man. Salute to the subscribers, that notification gang, etc., etc. Don't let that get too far ahead of you. There are folks, salute to everybody that watches this content, whether religiously or in passing, battle rappers, MCs, who feel like Cortez versus Sue Surf should be canceled and it should never happen again. Uh, I was watching a Daylight blog, and you know, Daylight, he's came mad far in his career, did things like that, he's blowing up, he's got the music, he's gonna be battling again. I think his next battle is actually versus Sue Surf. And uh, he said, and I've been hearing this reiterated from mad people, that maybe that Cortez should not take Surf anymore because of what happened in the fallout and how now Surf's you know, credibility or street credibility, which he already had, has now superseded or skyrocketed, you know what I'm saying? They was even saying kind of bars like, you know, well, you know what would have happened if I say smash him? Pause. But, uh, no, I think it should. I think it should. I think it should still happen. And here's the reason why. There's many reasons why. Cortez earned this. Like, however he got it, I hear people saying, you know, uh, be that back dog. I don't really feel like he backed out. He's got other things going on. Prioritization in your career is important. But he deserves this. Three Letter Man has an interview with Cortez on his channel, PSA Hip Hop. Go check that out. And Cortez spoke about the battle and a lot of people's first inclination were like, yo, did Surf throw the battle? Did he call a blitz? Did he, you know, have this situation happen because he wasn't ready? No, I've uh, spoke to people close to the situation and Surf was ready. He, had, he was ready, like AMG mode. That's how what he calls it. AMG mode, he was ready and it was gonna be one of them ones. Like, see, first of all, the crowd was rocking with it. They was giving people reaction when they needed it. They were booing if need be. They were. They did what they were supposed to do. That was not a bad crowd. I've seen bad battle rap crowds before. Like when people are rapping, you can't even get your bars over. They talking through your shit. Whoop de whoop. That was a good crowd. That was definitely. When you see Charlie Clips going crazy on Luke Castro, I'm gonna talk about that shit in another joint. I got like two, three joints today. Walk with me, you know what I'm saying? I got some time today. Uh, salute to my guy, Showtime SPs, taking care of some business with the family. I'll see him in a, in a little second, you know what I'm saying? I know people's like, oh, where's the breakdown? Woo -woo. I got you, we got you. Salute to my brother, Showtime SP. He's got the uh, tournament going on this weekend with Pass versus Bill Collector for 100 bands. I'll talk about that too. Don't worry, I got you, I got you, I got you. Salute to everybody that watches this, I appreciate you. Um, so, you have a situation where uh, Cortez is speaking on, and then you should go watch the interview, you know what I'm saying? Go watch it with, with uh, Three Letter Man, you'll see what he was talking about. Where a lot of people had, uh, you know, predicated like, did he surf throw the battle? I didn't feel that way. I know it's a lot of joking and shit, you know what I'm saying? Niggas be joking and shit. But uh, I thought he was ready. I thought he wanted to continue entertaining that crowd and doing what he was doing, and the battle didn't happen, right? So since it didn't happen, you know, people say, oh, should it be in a small room? It should not be in a small room. I do not think, no, 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 absolutely not a small room because then now it's a controlled environment. You let in just certain people, certain this, and they, they, the, the general public deserves to see this. And the folks who were there, you know, because it probably won't be in the same state, you know what I'm saying? It probably will not be in Atlanta because they just had an event in Atlanta. So if you move it to another state, I think the folks who actually paid and were there should have an opportunity if they want to go to the next joint, wherever it's at, for a discounted rate or for free. Because they came to see that. And if you didn't see that and it happens somewhere else, then the folks who took the time out should at least have the opportunity. Some people may not be able to. You know, I was only off. You know, my job only gives me three days off every couple months and I use them. Boop, boop, boop. Cool. Watch it on caffeine. But Cortez should get that shot. He's uh, battled uphill for like his whole career. Uh, he's often been said, you know, you're not this, you're not that, you're not getting top tier money, your default situation. But to see the way that he's handled this, the way he's handled this is uh, is is good. Like he's 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 good money. He didn't jump out the window and start talking crazy. He could have been online. He could have been wilding. He just stayed quiet, watched the room, and seen what was going on. And now he's like, he still wants, he's like, yo, the material is still there, the bars are still there, I was ready to go off. And was it gonna be an uphill battle? It was gonna be an uphill battle because you're looking at a situation where most people 
felt like Surf was going to win just because of quote unquote star power. I did feel like he was Surf was still going to get it 2 1. I didn't feel like he was going to clear him. He might have. Who knows? I don't know. But there's a, there's a puncher's chance that Core would have cleared him because Cortez is a puncher. He punches. He has punches. He has uh, different pockets of flows. He could rebuttal a little bit. Like, he's got, you know what I'm saying? And then he, he got a pen where he could, like, like, he's a difficult MC when he's in his bag and when he's really, really worked. Like, go watch him versus official. And I got a couple other battles that if you really want to see whether he gets busy or not, but it's not even about that right now. So, it should still happen. Uh, daylight. It should. But, um, I get it. I, I do see and respect his perspective on it because he's an actual battle rapper. You know what I'm saying? He's saying it from the and he's saying it from the avenue of look, all of this has happened, and now you're gonna go try to battle that. But shoot, dog, you want daylight? You gonna battle that too? I'm just saying. I know y'all are two totally different MCs doing two totally different things, but I don't think it should be canceled because. The thing is, if they don't battle and if it gets canceled, now Cortez has to live with that on his resume, along with all the other random bullshit. This battle got vaulted. This battle backed out. Like, he just got bad luck. He might own a black cat. I don't know what's going on in Brooklyn, but he he's just has all of this bad luck that happens when it comes to his battles. And I could never tell you what the feeling is to be there, be prepared, be ready in your, with the microphones on and everything, ready to go out there on stage and prove everybody wrong and to get that moment snatched from you. It's kind of crazy, you know what I'm saying? I'm not gonna lie, it definitely is crazy to have that moment. Like if it happened, if this situation happened, and I'm not saying as far as like with the fight and everything, you gotta protect your people. I said that before and I'm gonna keep, i say that again, it doesn't matter. Like that's just across the board. You gotta protect your people, you gotta protect comes with you, woo, woo, woo. I get that, but he still does deserve his opportunity to do what he needs to do, you know what I'm saying? And I know people make up, you know, their own scenarios and their own rumors and this, that, and the third. And nowadays, the lie be more entertaining than the actual truth, you know what I'm saying? Like, people will make up lies on people every day. I got people that do it all the time. They'll cut on the camera and make up a whole story about me. Never met me, don't know me, we never had no conversation. But their truth be their truth. But when you entertain, it's like, I'm not, I'm not going to entertain Bullshit, you know what I'm saying? Because I don't know you, you don't know me. This is all about battle rap. It's not about battle rap. We ain't got nothing to talk about. My kids, nothing. Like, that shit has nothing to do with nothing. But back to this. So, Daylight does have some valid points in his conversation about this. And I do respect him. But Cortez does deserve his shot. Like, he needs to be able to get that work off. Like, he prepared. And one thing I do respect, Cortez did make a very good point. We was more hype, like with the grudge, to see this. Like, I, and they, he sold it. They sold it. I, I watched the twerk battle. I watched the, uh, the loaded, lo all of them joints. Calico, John John and Don. John John and Don and Surf was supposed to be a grudge match. Was supposed to be. Surf goes in there, washes, and woo de woo. But I'm gonna, I ain't gonna lie, this Cortez shit, like, when it was first announced, a lot of niggas was like, nah, son, what the fuck is this? We ain't doing this. We not about to do that. But the way it got sold and the way that they was going at each other, you can't tell me you ain't want to see what Cortez. I wanted to see what Cortez was going to do battling that stage, that crowd, that environment, and Sue Surf with the white tee on. You know what I'm saying? Him and Goods is going back. I got something about that. Just, just stay in tune with me. Take this walk with me. Um, but overall, yes, don't cancel this. Don't, 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 no matter what, it has to happen. Especially if that money went out. Once that money go out, once the money, and they're, they're gonna make it happen because Mulk's got paid, you know what I mean? Like, if I show up to battle and I'm prepared and the battle don't go down for whatever reason, my time is everything. You gotta pay me, you know what I'm saying? You have to. You're gonna lose more money. Cause you gotta pay me for that battle that I just showed up for, it wasn't there. Now if you want a new day, you gotta pay me again. You gotta fly me out again. You gotta, like, they're gonna get the battle done. You know what I'm saying? So I'm gonna speak, we always complete the objective and all. They're gonna get the battle done. But when you move the battle, you move the scenario, you know, people having current event bars and relevant shit that happened and rapping about the states and, you know, I don't know how you go, uh, 
It'll get Falcon, I'm brave, it's not Atlanta, you know, it's how you get a not Atlanta, you know how that shit go. So wherever they move it to, you're gonna have to update your material. When you update your material, that's money too. Everything is a business, you know what I'm saying? I, you paid me for this, it happens on this day. But the overall, overall, we need this to still happen. These niggas put in that work. Surf had three battles in a row, two three O's, two ones, whatever you want to call it. But we not, we not about to dead Cortez on his opportunity. He's got to get his opportunity because um, it could be one of the biggest what ifs. What if the joint happened? Not knocking why it didn't, respectfully, but they should still happen. Straight up, gone.